morning students today we are going to learn question and answers from the chapter force and energy which is chapter number 11 from our textbook the first question is tick the correct answer then question number b will be fill in the blanks question number c would be change the underlined word to correct the statements d would be write short answers and e would be answer these questions so let us start with tick the correct answer the first tick the correct answer is we are able to stay on the ground because of this is a question the options are gravitational force elastic force buoyant force frictional force so what do you think is the correct answer well students the correct answer is gravitational force let us see second sub question a screw jack used to lift a car is a dash and what are the options first class lever pulley second class lever or screw so what do you think is the correct answer the correct answer is screw this is the image of the screw third question the most readily available source of energy is the options are wind energy solar energy geothermal energy water energy so what do you think is the correct answer right solar energy as you can see from this particular figure this is most readily available source of energy let us see fourth question the upward push of water on a floating object is in this image you can see a ship which is floating on water okay what are the options buoyant force volume density pressure so what do you think is the correct answer right buoyant force okay so buoyant force is a force which is responsible for that upward push on the object now students let us see fill in the blanks and in that the first is most simple machines make use of a dash force what do you think is the correct answer well the correct answer is mechanical force then second there is no dash force in space what would be the answer for this gravitational force so students gravitational force is not there in space okay third fill in the blanks simple machine change the dash of the applied force what do you think is the correct answer right direction okay simple machine change the direction of the applied force let us see fourth fill in the blanks a moving car poses mechanical energy due to its dash what do you think is the correct answer right motion a moving car poses mechanical energy due to its motion let us see fifth fill in the blank an inclined plane is a dash which makes work easier and the answer to this question is slope an inclined plane is a slope which makes work easier so students let us see question number c change the underlined word to correct this statement and first in that list is a stretched rubber band regain its original position on being released because of gravitational force is it correct no the correct statement would be a stretched rubber band regain its original position on being released because of elastic force okay let us see second question geothermal energy is a non-renewable source of energy is it correct no geothermal energy is renewable source of energy okay third question the pulley used for drawing water from a well is a movable pulley and what will be the correct statement of this the correct statement would be the pulley used for drawing water from the well is a fixed pulley let us see fourth question simple machines make our work complicated is it true no the correct statement would be simple machines make our work easier okay fifth question we are able to walk because of elastic force the correct statement is we are able to walk because of frictional force okay remember students if frictional force is not there it would be very difficult to walk on any surface okay now the next question is write the short answers and first in that list is name the different types of forces here you would write muscular force mechanical force elastic force gravitational force frictional force are the different types of forces i will repeat the question name the different types of forces you will write the answer muscular force mechanical force elastic force gravitational force frictional force are the different types of forces let us see second question what are simple machines here you will write simple machines are tools we use to help make work easier 
थर्ड क्वेश्चन वाई जियो थर्मल एनर्जी रेफर टू एज रिन्यूएबल सोर्स ऑफ एनर्जी आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज जियो थर्मल एनर्जी इज रिन्यूएबल सोर्स ऑफ एनर्जी बिकॉज द वॉटर इज रिप्लेनिश्ड बाय रेनफॉल एंड हीट इज कंटिन्यूसली प्रोड्यूस्ड इन साइड द अर्थ लेट एस सी फोर्थ क्वेश्चन From where does most of the heat energy come from? Here you will write most of the heat energy we use come from burning fuels like coal, kerosene, and petrol. Let us see fifth question. Name the different forms of energy. The answer to this question is mechanical energy, heat energy, light energy, and electrical energy. These are the four different forms of energy. Then comes the long answer questions. The Question is answer the following questions. And first in that list is what is liver? On what basis are livers classified? Here you write a liver is a simple machine consisting of a beam or rigid rod pivoted at a fixed hinge or fulcrum. Livers are classified by relative positions of the fulcrum, effort, and load. Okay, so this is the answer to question number one. Let us see second question. What are inclined plane? How is it useful for us? Well, the answer to this question is an inclined plane is a slope or a ramp. Examples: a ramp used by workmen to push a heavy load on wheels into truck, ramps for wheelchairs, ramps to load luggage onto plane, an escalator, slope such as slide of a hill, which is natural inclined plane. Though roads in the hills make longer distances but are easier than climbing straight up okay students so this is a question to second long answer question okay let us see third question does a screw join two pieces of wood better than a nail how the answer to this question is screws have a threaded shaft that hold better in wood and draw boards together much more tightly and they have greater tensile strength compared to nails screws also do a better job of holding tight during wood's natural expansion and contraction so this is answer to third question fourth question what does the law of conservation of energy state well energy can neither be created nor be destroyed energy just changes from one form to another the total energy of an object never decreases or increases so this is law of conservation of energy well student with this we have arrived on the last question for the day the question is how is wind energy more environment friendly than heat energy the answer to this question would be wind is a renewable source of energy using wind to produce energy has a fewer effects on the environment than many other energy sources wind turbines do not release emissions that can pollute the air or water and they do not require water for cooling Wind turbines may also reduce the amount of electricity generation from fossil fuels which result in lesser air pollution and carbon dioxide emissions. Heat energy on the other hand come burning fuels like kerosene, coal and petrol which release harmful gases leading to air pollution. So this is the answer to fifth and the last question for the day. Well students if you have any questions feel free to ask. Thank you for attending this session. See you during next session with a new topic. Until then, take care. Bye bye.